here we are, everybody. Memorial Hill. Yo, Zerkatry, where are you at? Why are these people not running in fear of death? Found it. First try. Damn. That was so satisfying. That Zergatry got hella caught. Um, I don't know what to do here. I might just weaken it and then throw a beast ball at it. Honestly, like... Electric doesn't resist bug, right? Will this knock me out? Oh, Munchie's surviving! Ooh! That's nice damage, Munchies! Alright, don't worry. Don't worry, Munchies. We got this, man. Oh, he actually broke out! Damn it! I'm sorry, Munchies. The Beast Ball is really weird when it catches the Pokemon, or when it goes in, because it like, stops and then like, turns in midair, and then like, falls. I don't know. I feel like the other ones don't do that. It might just be me. I don't know. Let's go out in a nippy! Chuck another Beast Ball at this man. Yeah, easy peasy. I don't know why they felt the need to make the beast balls because a hey, levels because the um the ultra beasts have the same catch rate as like all the other legendaries. They're not any harder to catch. Or oh, actually. Zerkatry has a pretty high catch rate compared to... It says Zerkatry's catch rate is 30. Oh, so they have varying catch rates. The Ultra Beast. Because... Uh, Pokemon like Registeel... Like the Regis, their catch rate is 3. Why is Kartana's catch rate, like... Guaranteed? What the heck? Their catch rates are really weird. Um... But yeah, so Guzzlords is pretty low. But yeah, the um, the catch rates of like Registeel and stuff is like three. Zerkatry was thirty, so I don't I don't see why they felt the need to make something like a Beast Ball to catch Pokemon that like aren't even as hard as normal legendaries to catch. You know? I don't know. Because catching it with the Beast Ball, you see how easy that is. Just get it into yellow. You're getting like three shakes every time. Guaranteed. I'm going to heal up Munchies. And then we're going to talk to Looker. Alright, Looker. What's cooking? I finished the mission. Amazing. Bravo, you done it. Oh. Beautiful. I think I'm a professional now. Professional Yuba catcher. I finished sending the data from the UB you protected to HQ and to Miss Wiki as well. Thank you for your hard work, New Age. We should unravel the mysteries of circuitry, also known as UB Lightning. <laughs> UB Lightning. Oh no. She said, Nyeh. Are you alright, ma'am? Yes, I'm fine, Mr. Looker. I just felt a passing vertigo, but I'm fine. Please do not worry yourself. But I must. I insist on worrying. You have always had the stamina of a machamp, Chief. I cannot believe this is nothing. No, please. It's nothing so serious. I'm sorry for causing you to worry about me. I insist that I really am fine. Putting all that aside, I must say that we have found a great ally in New Age. What a fantastic trainer. It was all that I could do, simply keep circuitry away from the town. 
The UB seem to get terribly aggressive when they spot me. It's like they're treating me as a prey or an enemy. Ah, uh, I'm sure it's only your imagination, Chief. You must be exhausted. Yeah, go take a nap. Nanu! I knew it was going to be Nanu. He's always lingering in the background, watching. I let myself in. Mr. Nanu. <laughs> Wearing flops. Yes. You been keeping well? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you, you, you are. <laughs> <laughs> so it is you. 100, Kurt, or what? <laughs> Sorry, what is it now? Looker? Yes, it is. <laughs> What's this? No smile for me? Here I am coming out of my way to bring you info about the UB that you're searching for. Are you really? That monster you're calling Blade. It's on Ula Ula Island. Dang, how many UBs are in this game? I thought like there were like exclusives. Or like more exclusives, not as many that are in both. But I mean, this is cool. And oh, and your information, it's all true. I'm the Kahuna of Ula Ula Island. If you don't do something about that monster for me, our guardian's not going to be happy. Oh, thank you for the information, Mr. Nanu. See you around then. Speaking of, I still need to catch another uh, Tapu. My fave Tapu. As far as design goes, anyway. Mr. Looker? Yes, yes, ma'am. Mr. Looker, do I take it that you're acquainted with Mr. Nanu? I knew him once, I thought. Never mind that. Right now we need to focus on our mission. Oh, dang. Maybe Nanu or Looker are not that great of peeps. Of course, yes, you're right. If we have reports of a new UB sighting, then our mission is first priority. I will move to Ula Ula Island and prepare our new base in the motel there. Please join us there as soon as you're ready, New Age. I'll go to Ula Ula. I trust that you will as well, New Age. The motel on Ula Ula Island is on Route 13. Faux show. Well, while you guys are doing that, I'ma go get us our last Tapu. Wait, I've never been through here before? What the heck? Dang. I really am messing up on some things, aren't I? Do I have to go through a whole desert to get here? Oh gosh. Okay. Hold up now. I'm not trying to go through... Aw, oh, that was adorable. All these desert encounters and such. We're going straight to my man Tapabulu. This place is... Stupid confusing. But I looked up a map, so ha! <laughs> Finally got the last Z crystal. This whole time it was here, the place I hadn't been to yet. And then we gotta get to the ruins by going this way, it would seem. Wow. That took forever. And I'm glad I didn't make that into part of the episode. I'm I'm glad I didn't find this place before when I like was exploring everything and stuff because I would have just been lost there forever and it would have sucked. But now we found me boy Tapu and we can catch this man. Um, uh, hmm. I just want to make sure I'm going the right way. I guess that is the only way I can go. The puzzles aren't that hard. Or hard at all. I don't know if this is the right way. 
Yeah, because if I move that all the way down, yeah. It's it's not meant to be hard. It's just meant to be in the way. I guess. What's good? What's Tapa Bulu's catch rate? See, Tampa Bulu's catch rate is three. That's an actual legendary. So this man would not be as easy to just chuck a Pokeball at. But we're gonna do that. We gonna do just that. What's good, friend? Hey, Tapu Bulu. What level are you at, bro? 60. Woo! You're strong. Skull Bash, Mega Horn, Zen Headbutt, Nature's Madness. You have a lot of attacks. Alright, let's see. So what would be a good Pokeball to catch you in? Hmm? Red. Black. And yellow. I say either a repeat ball or a level ball. I keep trying to use the level ball and it doesn't look right. I think Bulu is the one. Oh yeah. Bulu is the one for the level ball. I'm going to keep track of all of his moves too. Because this one would actually be hard to catch. Alright, let's see. Nature's Madness, Zen Headbutt, Mega Horn, Skull Bash. The cool thing about Skull Bash is it uses a turn. So, that's just more time to catch this man. Let's do it. Okay, okay. What I'm wondering is how well we're gonna take these. Not bad. We have other Pokemon to take it anyways. Tapu Bulu can't really do anything to, uh, frickin' Nippy anyways. Don't worry, Munchies, don't worry. I got you. We'll let, we'll let Nippy take care of this one. And then he's used one of his Mega Horns now. Two of his Mega Horns. Alright. That's the only one that'll actually do damage, other than Nature's Madness, which we'll have, but... You know, I don't mind healing up every so often. We're getting shakes like a madman. How does the level ball work? And we're getting that HP? Thank you. Alright, not anymore. Pokeball that makes it easier to catch a Pokemon that are at a lower level than your own. Oh. Well, it is lower. Maybe you should use someone else then. Who's at a... Lower level than Tapu Bulu. So it's even harder. Let's try that. Let's try Wingo. None of his move. I mean, I guess Zen Headbutt, that just does normal damage. I don't know, let's see. Let's see how well we could take it. As he goes for a Skull Bash again. So we get another turn to just chill. Weakening Pokemon is overrated. Nowadays, it's all about just catching them. We're still getting the shakes. Still getting them. All right, well, that did a lot. Let's switch out again. Let's just go back in and nippy. He can take it all the best anyways. Yeah, 
He actually goes for Nature's Madness this time. And thank you, Nippy, for that skillful dodge. Keep only getting one shake. There it is. Now, I think Mega Horn can knock me out from here, so... I need to get some HP going. I don't want anyone to die, because I like them all getting the experience for when we catch it. This man's Zen head button. Nah. Alright. Let's go, Pokeball! I've really been wanting to use the level ball on something. So I'm glad it was Tapabulu. Mmm. Also, damn. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, that did a lot. Hmm. I'm enjoying that I'm getting to use the level ball on something. Oh, he's going for it again? Oh, no, that was in headbutt. Mobby. Tapu Bulu is so cool. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's coming. <laughs> oh! <coughs> we keep only getting one shake. I don't like it. But Nippy is eating up every hit. Damn it. We're only getting one shake. I still don't think Megahorn can knock us out yet. Damn it! There's the Mega Horn. Yep. Don't worry, Nippy. I got you. You're not gonna die that easy. Mm hmm. Hey! Get predicted. Damn it! <laughs> this Tapu Bulu cannot hit anything. Damn it! We have not gotten past one shake. There's the Mega Horn. Oh my gosh, that man crit us. This man's getting all the crits. Damn it. Ha! <laughs> That's what you get. And you're about to be out of Mega Horns. You have two left. Yeah! Ooh! Not even bad. Huh. That one wasn't even as hard as Zerkishri. Well, actually, it was equally as hard. It just didn't take as long. Oh, yeah! And now we officially have all the tapus. Not even bad. What happens now? <laughs> Ha! <laughs>
Hell yeah. Look at that. That's nice. All the tapus in my possession.